Hey guys, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Chapter 23, Gauss Law, Fundamentals of Physics by Halliday Rasnik Walker, edition 10, uh, problem number 23. The drum of a photocopying uh, machine uh, has a length of 42 centimeters and a diameter of 12 centimeters. So we have this drum of a photocopying machine, length is 42 centimeters, diameter is 12 centimeters, that means radius is 6 centimeters. The electric field is just above the drum surface. Now that's important. Just above the drum surface is 2.3 into 10 to the power 5 Newton per coulomb. What is the total charge on the drum? Then there is part B. We'll uh, go through that in a while. First, let's go for part A. Okay, so part A. Now, uh, drum is a metallic body here. Photo, uh, drum of a photocopying machine and for uh, a conducting body we know from Gauss law you must be aware of this after going through this chapter field just outside a metallic body is sigma divided by epsilon zero just outside a metallic body just above the surface of a metallic body is sigma divided by epsilon zero where sigma is charge per unit area so that is q divided by a and we have epsilon zero already there and this Q is what we had find out, total charge on the drum. So this implies Q is equal to epsilon 0 A into E, which is epsilon 0. Now area, surface area of a cylinder is 2 pi R L in 2 pi R L and then we have this E there. So let's substitute the values. We'll substitute everything in SI system. So epsilon is 8.85 into 10 to the power minus 12 into 2 into pi is 3.14 into r r radius is 6 centimeters so 6 into 10 to the power minus 2 meters okay we'll convert it to a si system length is 42 centimeters so 42 into 10 to the power minus 2 meters and then electric field is 2.3 into 10 to the power 5 newton per coulomb that's already in si system so we have used everything in si system so the charge we'll get will also be in SI system, meaning in coulombs. So this is what you have to work out. I have already done that. It comes out to be 3.2, 3.2 into 10 to the power minus 7 coulomb. Okay, 3.2 into 10 to the power minus 7 coulomb. Okay, then uh, part B. The manufacturer wishes to produce a desktop version of, the, of this machine. This requires reducing the drum length to 28 centimeters. So new length of the drum is 28 centimeters and the diameter to 8 centimeters. Diameter is 8, that means radius is 4 centimeters. So we have new radius 4 centimeters. So length has changed, radius is now uh, changed. The electric field at the drum surface must not change. So this electric field is same, 2.3 into 10 to the power 5. What must be the charge on this new drum? So exactly same, just the new values, okay, just the new values. So part B, I'll directly begin with this, Q is equal to epsilon 0, 2 pi R L into E, okay, from this equation. I'm starting from this equation. The only thing different is values of R and L, rest, is, rest everything is same. So let's substitute the values, again 8.85 into 10 to the power minus 12. 2 into pi is 3.14, r is 4 centimeters, so 4 into 10 to the power minus 2, l is 28 centimeters, so 28 into 10 to the power minus 2, field is 2.3 into 10 to the power 5 newton per coulomb. So everything is in SI system, okay, everything is in SI system. So this implies Q is equal to, this is what you have to uh, work out, I have already done that. It comes out to be 1.4 into 10 to the power minus 7 coulomb. So this is charge of the new drum. Okay, this is charge of the new drum. So that's it. That'll do for this session.